So we've driven from Ocean Beach right around the Wainui coast as far as we can go. We've come to a massive slip behind us where the road is closed, so no more. So we'll just um, do the old handhold on the sill hold the camera and the little drive out. Nothing too exciting. A couple of little little bumps and um, a couple of little water holes. It's a fairly decent drop off on the right hand side. You certainly wouldn't want to fall asleep at the wheel and fall over there. Last night was extremely windy. The tent was moving all over the place. Today it's looking like a 30 degree day with no clouds in the sky. An absolutely stunning view out to the right. You'll have a look at the right one. Right across to Cape Palliser. It's just gorgeous. Blue, light blue coloured water. Just before I started filming, just chatting to a couple of hunters going into the Mokamoks. They're going to be hot today walking up a hill hunting. Is that what it's called today? Where they go into the Mokamoks? Yeah, the Mokamok track goes over into the Arongarongas in Wellington. Yeah, they it's the Mokamoka Valley, on. I think. What was that? They have heaps of clothes on. Yeah, they have long pants and long tops to stop from being sunburned, and, but they're going to they're gonna sweat. It's impassable. There is a beach option, but you wouldn't do it alone. Uh, it's tidal, so if you got caught, you'd have a very limited opportunity to get your wagon out before the tide got you. Sorry for the bouncy camera, but she doesn't really have much of a chance. <laughs> She's holding it with her hand, and I'm not making it easy for her. video he does a lot of diving but he didn't bring his gear we're not going to stay here again tonight because the wind is forecast to get up again tonight so we're going to go up to probably the wire heady gorge up further up the wire upper just left just before masterton so lots of little side tracks here going down to the beach but paul doesn't have recovery points on his truck so i'm not going to go down onto the beach just in case i hit the soft stuff and no one to recover me. That would be bad. Uh, 
the next spot that we're going to find. So lots of batches all around, so if she pans up there's another coastal batch. So these are all private batches on public land, so there's a fight about them being allowed to be here. But they must take an absolute beating from the, the weather. This next one has been done up quite nicely. That one's beautiful. Probably do us for now, so you can probably switch that off. 